Hello, I'm Keenan Punkocher, and this is your Daily Barometer News Blast. Despite a stunning upset at home against USC on Friday, in which the Beavers lost 70-50, the Oregon State women's basketball team rebounded in a big way, defeating number 15 UCLA 68-61 on Sunday. Turnovers hurt the Beavers throughout much of the game Friday, as USC would finish with 28 points off of 20 Oregon State turnovers. Oregon State allowed a season-high 48% shooting to the Trojans on Friday, but resumed playing their lockdown style of defense, giving up only 36% to UCLA. Although senior Sydney Weiss struggled finding her shot this weekend, she found help from her teammates on the bench as Oregon State would finish 21-9 in bench points versus UCLA. The Beavers will rest before preparing for the mountain road trip this weekend in Utah and Colorado. Number 4 Utah was in town on Saturday to take on the Beavers during the annual Dam Cancer Meet at Gill Coliseum. Oregon State won in thrilling fashion, defeating the Utes 196.550 to 196.525. Beavers floor anchor Katiana McMillan needed to score better than a 9.9 .9 in order to win as she scored a 9.925, fueling the team victory and her second consecutive individual all-around title. This was the first victory over a top five opponent since 2013. You can spend your Valentine's Day building soft skills in a low pressure environment. The Career Development Center invites you to attend a short interview session to hone your interview skills with employers who recruit at Oregon State. This simulation will be held in the Memorial Union Horizon Room from 1 to 4 p.m. You can register for a 40 minute time slot with your Beaver Careers account. The History Department invites you to attend Representing Our Own Tibet, a lecture by Lee Miller. In this talk, the paintings, installations, and photographs of several Tibetan artists will be explored, with attention paid to the context, strategies, and experiences that inform the works. This event will take place in Milam, 319 from 5 to 6 p.m. For complete stories from the day's news blast, visit our website at orangemedianetwork.com. Follow us on social media and make sure to pick up this week's issue of The Barometer on newsstands around campus. From all of us here at Orange Media Network, I'm Keena Punkocher. Thank you for watching.